I've had um, quite a lot of interest in the video that I posted about a year ago on this LE 4656 or something Samsung TV and as you can see there's this vertical line fault um, and basically I replaced practically all the boards in this TV and it still exhibits this vertical line fault and a lot of people seem to have this problem it seems to be quite um, common I think it's not actually the boards but the um, LCD screen itself uh, but in my case all is not lost so um, I inherited this TV off my dad because he couldn't he, it wouldn't work for him so he bought a new one and um, I've continued to use this TV because I've found a way of getting rid of the vertical line fold. Um, so as you can see, it's still coming up, even though it disappeared there. So um, we found that if we used it for long enough and the TV warmed up, then the lines would disappear. But actually, there is another way on this TV to get rid of the fold. So I'm going to turn the TV off. Now, instead of turning the TV on to an HDMI mode uh, by pressing, because it's on an HDMI mode at the moment, I think, you press the power button and it would bring it back to that mode, um, or in, and instead of turning it on to um, the built-in TV tuner, digital TV tuner, if you actually turn the TV on to analog mode, So I've just pressed 1 on my remote control here. We get the fault for a little while. Okay, it didn't work that time. Right, well that's good that it's good that it didn't work because I can show you what what actually you should have you should do. So if you click the source button on your remote control until you can get I mean, I, I think that's it there, actually, because it's all it's mainly white on the screen. Basically, you're trying to get the TV into uh, the analog TV tuner mode. So let's try that again. Turn it off. And now I turn it on by pressing 1. There we go. So that was that was the analog TV tuner mode, and obviously because most of the, um, or if not all of the analog transmitters have been turned off, we just get static. But for some reason, turning it on in that mode uh, gets rid of the fault very quickly. So now it's completely usable. If I change the source, I can go. I think I can go through all of these. I've got a um, TV dongle installed in here so it'll load up Netflix in a second there we go so it's all working um, it's it's completely usable like this I've kind of got used to just when I turn it on um, I just press the uh, one button on the remote instead of the uh, power button and then for some and for some reason usually that uh, loads up the analog TV thing. So try this out, um, and you might find out might find that this fixes the problem for you on this television. Um, if not, it could be something. Uh, I would try replacing the other boards on the TV if you got the uh, technical wherewithal to to try that. Um, if not, throw it out and buy a new TV. But certainly, this does seem to be a fix for the uh, LE40A656 um, vertical line fold.